What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable FIFA 23 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com. Next time you guys want to buy your coins and make your team even better, go to the website and type the code DAN to get 6% off your next purchase. Also, if you ever want to sell your FIFA 23 coins, you can go to the same website under the Self Foot 23 coin section. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all boys. And today we got a special player to review, and it's potentially the most broken card in FIFA history. We're looking at a 93 rated Shapeshifters SPC Milinkovic Savic Vanja. We're looking at a card at 6'8, medium high work rates, right foot, 5 star skill most, 4 star weak foot, 90 pace, 87 shooting, 92 passing, 91 dribbling, 93 defending, 96 physicality. And he has outside the foot shot trait as well. Now, this card can get on lengthy as well, which is absolutely insane. So, we're going to go ahead and give him the shadow chemistry style. Acceleration gets maxed out. Sprint speed, 98. Defending stats get maxed out. Strength at 99. Aggression at 96. Everything in the dribbling category, 91 plus, except for agility being 82. This card looks absolutely insane. And for some reason, he gets full cam. I don't know if you guys can explain to me in the comment section down below. How does the Shapeshifters promo works? But I only have one Serie A player on the team, and he gets full chem, so I don't know anything about that. But he is going to be playing in a 4-3-2-1. As a center man, box-to-box -box midfielder right next to team of the season, Alfonso Davies. Now, there is a potential that this card could be the best midfield in the game. I'm aiming for top five as of right now. But we're going to keep an open mind. We're going to play some foot champs, and hopefully... He clamps it up and scores a lot of goals for us. All right, here we go at our first game. For some reason, it's doing the no gamer tag slash team name glitches, but he has a pretty, he has a really good midfield. That's actually a really good team, so it's going to be a good test for Savage this game. And that is a great finish from the card, man, with the weak foot. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be a really big issue going against this card this weekend. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. What am I seeing from this Savage card? What the hell? I just tackled my own teammates. Dribbling feeling honestly like crispy as fuck. It's actually hilarious how good the dribbling is feeling. What a tackle from the boy Savage. That is a dot to Cruyff. That's an assist as well. So we move on that. It's going to be a potential rage quit, I believe. Yes, sir. So, absolutely insane first games from Savage. He had, what I have, two goals and one assist. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a very broken card. I can already tell. He had an interception. It was Savage. Unlucky shot with the weak foot. Nice interception. Almost an assist right there. That's tough. Nice interception, that was clutch. Nice interception. Might even lead to a goal, y'all boys. That's a pen, all right. So we got a pen in the fifth minute. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot with Savage himself. Hopefully this guy doesn't leave the game. I'm gonna go top right here. See if we can score this. And we do, good shot. What was that? That was such a bad shooting animation. Cheeky reverse elastico doesn't score that one, unfortunately. Savage with the clean finish with the weak foot. That was nice. Good stuff. Good ball. Unlucky Neymar.
unlucky. Alright guys, and that concludes the player review for 93 rated shapeshifters Milinkovic Savage coming around 145,000 coins on the PlayStation and Xbox if you do them from scratch, 152,000 coins on the PC. We played three games with the card, five goals and one assist as a box-to-box -box midfielder. Now, comparing this 93 rated to the... was he uh... no, we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that comparison. That comparison is ridiculous. Overall, my experience with the car was just as expected. He is very, very broken. So I highly advise if you guys need a midfielder that's in-game, very broken, go ahead and complete this SPC because like I said before, I don't know how he gets full cam. Maybe because he's a premium shapeshifters. Maybe the premium cards have some, something to do with that. But overall, this is just a must-do SPC. Um, he's everything. He's like a Hullet Vieira jude bellingham all in one you know musiala you got you got all the best midfielders into one card you know he has the height six eight absolutely amazing medium high work rates um you can honestly send him on manual runs yes i know he has medium high work rates like patrick vieira but you send him on manual runs he's going to contribute in the attack a lot and i absolutely love that you can put him on balance you can put him on stay forward and he will do just the job offensively. Five star skill moves, absolutely amazing. Four star weak foot, there were a couple opportunities we did score with the weak foot. 90 pace, someone that's 6'8 day, six day with 91 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, he fell very, very quick with and without the ball. 85 finishing, very good stat right there because he's probably one of the best finishing midfielders in the game. Dribbling. Um, he obviously didn't feel, he felt good. Let me get into that just a second. He felt good. He obviously didn't feel like a Musiala or like a Memphis Depay. But for somebody at 6'8 with those dribbling stats, he felt very, very good. Better than I expected dribbling wise. You know, his reverse elasticals were very smooth. Step over animations were absolutely amazing. Physicality. A1. Don't need to talk too much about that. Now, the defensive AI was something I was a little suspect going into this review because Malik of a Savage, goalkeeper, going into midfielder, center mid role, is does he have that defensive AI like Vieira and Hullet? I wouldn't say it's like Vieira, but it's still very, very good. It's still very good. And what makes it even better is because he's 6'8. So even if his defensive AI is not all that, the height compensate and helps him along with those defensive stats to intercept the ball you guys saw he was intercepting the ball easily and the best thing about the card what i like the most is that he has 90 plus pace but he is lengthy you guys get this card on lengthy absolutely broken no debate he's a top five midfield in the game top one you could make the argument obviously i would have to think off the top of my head do i consider this card better than team season jude bellingham I consider him better than Timothy or Hullet and those type of cards. For me, he's top five, no debate. You guys can let me know in the comment section down below. But card gets a thumbs up for me. And rating wise for 93 Shapeshifters, Milinkovic Savage Avanja is going to get a 10 out of 10. I think this is absolutely a, a must do SPC. There's nothing wrong with him. I would be very surprised if not a single person thinks this card is top tier. I mean, the stats are there, the height's there. The body type is there. He has everything, you know, and he gets full cam as well, which is absolutely amazing. So thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos. You guys are absolutely amazing. Very close to 5,000 subscribers. I don't know what's the next player we're going to be. It's probably going to be uh, Garincha, if not that double five Eto. I'll have to see. A lot of good players to review this weekend. So it's been your boy, Dan FIFA, and I'm out. Bye-bye.